going live. We're going live. We're going live. We're live. And we're back. And we're back. Ooh. We still have our celebration banner up. Oh, audio. Uh oh, no audio. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. You messed up my audio, Mark. Mm -hmm. We might need to restart and try again. In Input, internal microphone. It's reading it there. No. Hmm. I think I'm going to have to restart. Let me see if I can hear you on there. I don't think it's, I don't think it's picking us up. Hi. Let us know in the comments if you can hear us. Yes. I think we're having some. Can you micro hear us? <laughs> we're having microphone issues. So can you hear us? I don't know if it's uh we were playing around with an external mic. And yep, okay, she can hear us. It's okay. just not giving us it's the It's not waves. giving us a little yeah, the green. I wonder if it's because I have this turned off. I don't know. That's weird. Yeah. Okay. Well, if you can hear us, then I guess we're we <laughs> let us know go. if you can't. We're experimenting with some uh Centers. some different um equipment for our live stream so we actually got this new ring light so that was an amazon prime day find um and then we had an old microphone from when we used to have our video production company mm -hmm. mark's playing with the light it's probably this one mark originally went to college for theater theater lighting and design so he really likes light and all I like things. you to look good yeah when you're on air so he's no having break. he's having fun with uh some nerdy look toys I can change oh oh get him warm because you want to see us as warm people yes <laughs> <laughs> hi guys <laughs> thanks thanks for hopping on and watching so we have some fun stuff planned for tonight um yeah. I know I had messaged a lot of you guys and just asked you know what if we should keep doing our Tuesday night lives or if we should change up our schedule or go every other week. And uh, we just got a lot of feedback saying that we should stick with our Tuesday schedules. So um, I think we're going to continue to do lives every Tuesday is the plan. Um, and then we'll still post two videos a week. Um, right now we're doing Thursdays and Saturdays. So we'll probably go to like a Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, um, schedule with Tuesdays being live and I want to experiment um, with a fun format I'm thinking about doing every other Tuesday doing a tech talk Tuesday so I thought this next Tuesday next week uh, maybe doing something and just talking about all the fun things that we found on Amazon Prime Day uh, but I also work in K-12 technology so I thought that'd be kind of fun just to have some conversations around the impacts that technology has on our families and on our kids and all those sorts of things. So it's a growing topic on everyone's mind. It is. Yeah. So I thought that might be kind of a fun format to do. And then every other Tuesday we'll do fun family stuff. So um, we will see how it goes, but that's kind of our tentative plan for right now. So uh, if you guys think that sounds like a good idea to do the tech talk Tuesdays, um, let me know if that's something that you guys would be interested in watching I'm definitely interested to see what you guys think if that would be something that's fun. Okay. It looks like. Yes. Got, and thumbs up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> got some, some good feedback here. So, all right. Well, um, what we have planned for tonight is we have a couple things. So we have some Toy Story things that we've been wanting to unbox. Um, little guy is sleeping right now. So we'll probably start on the McDonald's toys. Um, and then hopefully he'll wake up and join us. Um, he's been taking these like late afternoon naps because it's six o'clock for us right now. Um, so he falls asleep in the car on the way home um, and is refusing to take afternoon naps. So we'll see. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't know you did speech therapy. Um, we might need to talk to you a little bit more about yeah. Wally. We've been talking a lot about if he needs a little bit of speech therapy. We've noticed that like he's his vocabulary has grown a lot in the last year, but he still is having a hard time pronouncing like specifically the letter C. C, yeah, but like the cut, 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 like the back yeah. of your throat. He's yeah. just not um, announce pronouncing that correctly. Mm -hmm. So like candy and things like that, he can't he can't say. He calls candy TT. So or GG sometimes or GG sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Um. Okay, so that's, that's interesting to know. But yeah, so we're kind of 
wondering when that's going to change for him. Yeah. And he's starting a two day preschool program. So I think that'll be really good yeah. for him. Um, he does daycare with my mom right now, which is fantastic, but I think it'll be really good for him to just have some social socialization. So T and K is developmental. Okay. Well, that's okay. good to know. That's reaffirming. He'll be three at the end of August. So he's got, I think he's about, yeah. What is today? The 23rd. So his birthday is the 25th of August. So a little, little over a month, but he's, he's getting there. Yeah, okay. little guy. He's still a baby. Yeah, he's still our little guy. So, but I'm just, I want to, some of our friends have kids the same age and they're just so the articulate. Dangerous things comparing right? your children to I other know, children. I know, it's so hard, but I'm like, well, they're so articulate and they can say all these words. And um, <clears throat> yeah, so we'll see. We'll see. He'll, I think he'll get there. And I think when he goes to school and is around other kids too, that'll really help him with his uh, pronunciations. Mm -hmm. Well, as I've always told Irene that I had a problem pronouncing ours, and I probably still do. Mm -hmm. um, just so you I, never were a pirate then? No, I never was a pirate. No, could not do ours. <laughs> that would be I a had horrible to say, like, rainbow speech impairment runs. to have if you were a pirate. pirate. Yes, it would be. Are you making fun of me? What would even like, <laughs> what would happen if you were a pirate and you yeah. couldn't pronounce your ours? Yeah. I don't yeah. know. I don't know. I think you'd have to walk the plane. Yep. I don't know. Ship you off. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Sorry. I didn't feel bad. No. Uh, yes. So, we all so now you all can listen when I talk and be like, oh, yeah, he messed that R up. Way to go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or call me a pirate. I Arr. dreamed of being married to a pirate or dash. Yes. All right. So. I do like rum, though. He does like rum, and he can pronounce that R. Very funny. Never had a problem pronouncing yeah. rum. No, rum. <laughs> rum. I like some good wow, that's rum. a good tongue roll there. Yeah. Uh, Maybe that's what I was doing. Maybe. Okay, so. To the topic at hand, yes. Toy Story 4. Now, I get so lost in all of our videos. Have we posted our Toy Story 4 video yet? Did we post that? What was our Toy Story 4 video? Did we go to the movie? Yeah, we did. <laughs> I don't know if we did a Toy Story. See, all or our life just blends we did, at some point. We did a live. We did all of the Toy Story cars, the Hot Wheels. Mm -hmm. We collected all of those. I don't remember if we did anything with Toy think Story so. before. No. I don't think we were. We have a really, really fun video coming up for the Lion King. Oh, so Julia. we did a whole Lion King inspired day on Sunday, and it was super fun. Um, so that video, I would like to get it out this week, but it's just not going to happen. I think we'll get it out next week because we have another another really fun video about the Apollo lunar landing anniversary. So um, we had a really fun aviation day, too. Yes. So that one will come out on Thursday. And then the second part of our Magic Kingdom video from the 4th of July mm -hmm. will come out on Saturday and then next Thursday we'll have our Lion King video. Yeah. So um, that was a really, really fun day. We did. And, and no, you did not let me hold Walter up. No, 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 we could have done that. We could have done that. I know. But I kind of miss that like golden era of his childhood of yeah. being able to do the, go back to our, uh, our uh, dinosaur video of dino. Oh, dino rama. Dino rama. When we did the moonlight magic. Some guy raised his baby. No, 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 no. It, the dinosaur is live. Oh, yeah, that's dinosaur's right. Dinosaur is live. <laughs> the dinosaur is live. Like that. Yeah, they have the like dinosaur that comes yeah. out, and the guy in front of us like was feeding his child to the dinosaur. Mm -hmm. But it really looked like we're it feeding. Did. Yeah. It really did. Yeah. Okay, back. Sorry. Okay. Topic at hand. Oh, I would love if you could send me a developmental chart. That would be yeah. so helpful, and it would remove a lot of my mom anxiety. So. <laughs> Okay, so let's get to the topic of hand. Um, so we have been diligently collecting all of the Toy Story 4 Happy Meal toys. Um, we had to deploy some assistance with the Across effort. the country yes. assistance. Mark's mom also pitched in to help. Yep. That was huge. Yeah. Um, so they did not which, evenly I'm gonna post, distribute these things. I'm going to post that on our... So you you talk about talk about these for a second. And I'm what gonna, am I talking about? Just like what it is. Yeah. And I assume I'm not opening this one, right? No. No. Okay. So I how many of you participated or partook in the Toy Story Happy Meal toy hunt? Um, 
let us know because these things actually are kind of cool. They have a cool ultimate feature to them in the in the very end. Um, but then each one has its kind of own little uh, only little fun fun activity to it. So they're all kind of like carnival games that you play uh, mm -hmm. with each of them. Um, inside of here, you get a character. So you can see this is number one. Um, I had a good time with that instructing and teaching the McDonald's employees that the bags were numbered and that's where to find the number. And when yeah, I come in asking no for idea. number uh, four or something, like that's the number I'm looking for. Um, but they all have a little character in them. So number one was Buzz Lightyear. He has uh, a game. Yes. Um, they all have little stickers to attach. The lovely thing of parenthood is stickers so, to attach. Um, and then they all came with these little uh, tickets in here. They're little carnival tickets, and there's four. Three of them had a character, uh, and then fourth was. I regret doing this. You have to put it all back together. I'm gonna regret That'll be fun this. and exciting. The fourth ticket was. No, I gotta cover that up. I haven't turned it in yet. The fourth ticket was uh, like a prize yes. ticket that could potentially win trip uh, trips to Disney World, Walt Disney World in Florida. Um, so, hey, Disney Junkie Ashley, welcome. Yes. Uh, so we're talking about the Toy Story I mean, McDonald's I toys. Um, oh, and yes. last time I checked, not all of the so, yeah. prizes had been given away yet. So okay. you can still enter these until yes. August 5th. August 5th. Yep. Um, and so you if you little, have any left. Yeah, you get little rewards. I, I don't know if you have the McDonald's app on your phone. Um, I don't know where my McDonald's I know is. ours was like they were out of them. I think last week or two weeks ago, they had like a Wreck-It Ralph one and then they did, they've started the Lion King ones now. So. Yes, Ashley, you need to get yours entered because you can only do one per day yes. uh, and you have till August 8th. So those who are good at, or what they I say, August 5th? August 5th. Yes. Um, so those four uh, who are good at math, you only have, you know, 13, 14 days something left, like something that. like yeah. that. So, so you're going to want to get in there and do that. So there's the McDonald's app. You load it into the rewards or Toy Story section and then just scan one. Yes. So. So I have a box from McDonald's when they did these. The really cool thing about these was that if you got them all and there are 10 toys, you could put them together. I don't know if you can see that. And it would form this RV. So we wanted to get all of them so that we mm -hmm. could do it. Um, so. We'll show you what each one of the toys looks like, and then we're going to assemble it into the <laughs> vehicle live, which could be highly entertaining. Yep. Uh, but this was the first toy. This was Buzz Lightyear, and it looks like it's the little carnival game. You put him on here, and then he ah, shoots up. Ooh, good catch. <laughs> so they've got this, and then you'll see on the back, it looks like something. It looks like the side and the front of an RV. So they have all these stickers, and we did actually get one. I can't remember which one it was. It had a defective sticker set in it, so then we had to get another one. Um, so that is Buzz. That's the first one. By the way, our nephew, who likes to um, tell us things, said that they have, like, full sets at I, McDonald's. I, I guess have any do. of you ever experienced that? We went in multiple times yeah. and asked multiple different stores, and none of them had a clue. So As apparently they get about. these like customer satisfaction packs where they'll get a whole set of the toys and then the store, it's all like dependent on the manager, but the store can decide if they want to, how they want to use those. So they can sell them. Um, so some people can do that, but I think you have to go like pretty much right away and ask. And then my nephew had like friends that worked at McDonald's. So that's how he was able to like, he did all the Pokemon toys. Um, but it's definitely, it was a little bit of an effort to get a full set. Um, we missed number one. We got a bunch of twos, threes, and then I think we, I don't know, our, because there's just so many McDonald's around us, and we were trying mm -hmm. to kind of figure out, and some of them would like jump ahead to toy six and then go back to toy one. So it was just really hard to, <laughs> to get them all. So we actually had his mom back in Iowa help too, and so she sent us a bunch, and between the whole family, we yeah. ended up with two complete sets, almost a third. Um, yeah, it was yeah. kind of a challenge. So I'm impressed, actually, that you were able to get two Twice. complete sets. Yeah. And um, Blind Bags mentioned this customer appreciation box. 
Um, so that's yeah. interesting that it does exist. If you okay. wait midway. midway. Have a, okay, so it's like halfway through. Okay. You just went in and asked. Okay. Yeah, I did. I did. We tried, actually. but they wouldn't. <laughs> they, they were they were like clueless. All right, can we talk to a manager? Maybe you have better McDonald's employees Ours out were, there. Like, so so. Yeah, we went to multiple McDonald's in our town. And so that head scratcher. And one time I asked for a different toy, and I didn't. I get what was their previous toy set. I think you got Wreck It Ralph. Or I got a Wreck It Ralph yeah. toy. Yeah, it's like it was frustrating. Uh, okay, so here's toy two, and it's the aliens. Mm -hmm. So let me find that one. Oh. Here it is. So these are the little aliens. It's so kind of like whack a mole. Like whack an alien. Yep. Um, and that is actually the front of the RV. So you can see that. So that's toy two. I mean, you guys must have better McDonald's. Yeah, I'm you guys, I'm you. jealous because ours was like super dysfunctional. <laughs> dysfunctional McDonald's. All right, and then what was number three? I forget what number three was. Was it Bo Peep? Yes. Uh, yeah. We ended up with a lot of Bo Peeps. We have a lot of Bo Peeps. So if you're missing a Bo Peep, <laughs> leave us a comment. Yeah. So we've got... Number three, which is Bo Peep yep. here. And I think she's this one. So there's Bo. She's pretty cute. They're pretty well made toy. I was impressed mm -hmm. with the quality of them. And then she just sits on here. Oh my gosh. There we go. And she. You gotta know she has a thing though. What? She has things she hits. Oh, doesn't she? well, yeah. She has like targets, but I yeah. think we. I think Wally. Yeah. That, that was the thing. Some of these came with uh, other little, little like doodads, cardboard, cardboard bottles. Yeah. Some of them had a cardboard bottle, yeah. and I was like, yeah, we're going to lose those. And we did. Okay, so that's three. And number four. Oh my gosh. Of benefit blind bags is Walter loves chicken nuggets. So, yes. He was he, he was more than happy to consume he, the chicken of it. I was more than happy. To, meal. Yes, I was more than happy to consume his uh, French fries. So excited for a Hattie mm -hmm. meal. So this is number four, and this was Forky. I think we got a couple of Forky too. Yeah. Um, and that one is this That's guy, funny. and it has the ladder. Um, so this sits on here. I can't remember how. Oh, here we go. It's just right in here. Yeah. And then he can sit on here and it's kind of like the, you oops, fling him. the like dunk tank. And you fling him into the trash. And... <laughs> I didn't do very good with that. So that's Forky and he's really cute too. They're just really cute. The little characters mm -hmm. are really cute and all done. Um, so this is actually a part of the back of the RV. No, this is the side, yeah. The side, I yep. think. But then this goes on the back. This yep. is like the ladder on the back of the RV. So that's four. And then where's five? Oh my gosh. Here's five. Five is Woody. I could probably. Woody's also super cute. Um, so here's Woody, and I forget Woody is Ooh, this. I found oh. I found one of the bottles. <laughs> this was Woody, and he had like balloons or something, right, Mark? How did what did Woody do? He had like balloons that went in there. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really actually remember what he did. I think that. Were they these? I think you like had these balloons, but I never really understood how this one worked. I don't know. Oh, they do have numbers. I never noticed that. There's actually, I don't know if you can see that. Actually, On the actual toy itself. See, it says number five. Huh. I never noticed that. They all they all have those. So oh my gosh. And on this. Where do, where do these go? Where's where the one on this on? one? Now I'm like fascinated with this. There is a number on it. That is so crazy. Yeah, here. Um, never knew that. Here was some of the tickets since I found them in the bottom of our box. Yeah, they're also just cute. I think we'll keep yeah. those for yeah. something in the future. Something in the future. You never know what you could use something like this for. Okay, six. Wait, um, oh, this I'm is a... Wally's favorite is number six. 
Duke Boom. He likes saying that. He loves Duke Boom. He talks about Duke Boom all the time. I can't remember what piece goes with Duke Boom. Oh, where is that piece? What is it? Oh, this one. So he's got a little launcher. He goes in here. And then he. Is it the. Is he's going with him? Duke Boom! <laughs> that was pretty Duke Kaboom. That was. So Duke Kaboom, that's Wally's favorite one. I like Duke Kaboom too. We, we're big Canadian fans. <laughs> Although we don't I, love La Cellier. Uh, no. I kind of want to give it another try. I love truffle. Yeah. But it just wasn't our favorite. It wasn't our favorite mm. meal. We've made an effort over the last couple of years to eat everywhere in Epcot. I think mm. we've done every country. I don't think we actually did Italy. Well, I mean, kind of did we've, Italy. Yeah, we've done that on before. my birthday. Yeah. But, um, okay, number seven is Jessie, and she has um, the. I don't know what this is. What you would call this? She's on these like ropes, and then I, I think are you can like trying to spin her. I think so. I think you like pull it, and then it like. I don't know. I'm not very good at like making these toys work. But there's Jessie. And she's pretty cute too. So there's Jessie. Oh, these aren't the individual. Oh, they are the individual. Some, a lot of them are. And then, what do we have? Eight. Order. So eight is um, Ducky and Bunny. And it's this fun little um, wheel you can spin. Maybe if I'm there, we go. Oh, yeah, just and then like bounce like the little bounce thing. Oh, yeah. okay, like, yeah, I get it now. Like, you yeah. pull her down and she yeah. bounces, she bounces out. out. Um, so yeah, Ducky and Bunny, and then it's got the little squirrels that you turn like move along here as they go, and that's the back of the RV. And I think there's two left, so then number nine, it's the race thing, right? Hmm? right you got the wheel for that, yeah, 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 yep. Um, and then this one is um, Rex and Trixie. And this is number nine. And it's got this fun little, like, it's like the little rocket ships you sit in at the carnival. And it spins you around. Biggie just came to join us. Hi, Biggie. I'm super excited because I don't know if you guys are in the Disney YouTuber group. Um I think that's where it was from, was from the Disney YouTuber group. But we're going to do a box swap for dogs. So, there, and I think somebody's coordinating one for cats, too. Um, so, Ashley, if you're in here still, you should check that one out. Because I think you guys have a cat, right? I'm pretty sure you guys have a cat. Um, but oh, it would be fun to do that. Oh, now Biggie's mad. Biggie doesn't like cats. <laughs> <laughs> um. Jesse's cute. Yeah, I like the Jesse one. Mm -hmm. um, okay, and then number 10. Number the 10. last one was Gabby Gabby. Which I never got to see this one. S is creepy. Oh, I was like, why is that? Oh, I was reading it in Spanish. I was so confused. I was like, who is Takita Giratoria de Gabby Gabby? It's Gabby Gabby. She's the twirling teacup. Not the spinning teacup. The twirling. And so she goes on this little thing. And creepy. Yeah, I Gabby Gabby creeped me out. I mean, I get the story and it was sentimental, but she was also kind of mean. Like, did she really? Hey, spoiler well, alert. Spoiler alert. Yep, you gotta give the spoiler alert. Did she have to so, do that to Woody? I won't give it all the way away, but did she have to do that to Woody? I think you guys have all seen it. So there's Gabby Gabby. So did she spin on her own? No, or did there's she just a wobble. Thing. There's a thing. It's just showing this kind of like wobbling, wobble, wobble. I don't know. know. I The instructions for these toys are so hard to read sometimes, I swear. Okay, so I have all the stickers on. I've got them all assembled. Um, and did anyone else get the sticker sets? Yeah, did anybody get any of these sticker sets? They're so cute. Yeah, so I'll, I'll hold Ashley, them. Ashley, did you get any of these? They're so fun. My mother-in-law sent us like, 50. Yeah. Yeah. Sticker set. Look at all these. 
Woo! Apparently, in the McDonald's in Iowa, they found them right. in the back well, room actually, at the thing. If it was we'll over. have to send some of these to you because they're super cute, and we have yeah. a plethora. We have a quantity of them. So. Okay, so yeah. now we're going to do an engineering challenge. <laughs> no attempt to put this back together into an RV. Start a timer. Yeah, for real, because I'm already feeling overwhelmed. <laughs> Okay, so let's see if I can do this. Here we go. I'm totally going to do this to you. <laughs> Where's the instruction thing? Okay. What? They all came with these, and it does show you how to put them all together. So Mark is starting a timer. Let's see how long it takes me to do this. No pressure. No pressure. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Because you have to know like what numbers they maybe that's why they have the numbers on them. <laughs> I never thought about that. That's helpful. Okay, so one Hi, connects Molly. to nine. Where's nine? There's nine. Okay. Oh man, I'm so bad at this stuff. Okay. Ta-da! I got one piece together. So there's one and nine, and then I need six. <laughs> Um, that's seven. That's five. Four. Six. Yay! Okay, and there's six, and that's another wheel. And then I need four, which I just had, and I can't remember which one was four. Here's four. Okay. So there is one side of the RV put together. It does fall apart super easily. I don't like that. I really wanted it to stick together much more firmly than it does. Okay, so I'm going to put that down and then I'm going to do the other side. So I need 10. 10? Who was 10? That was Gabby. Yeah, that's this Gabby. No. Uh, no, that's not Gabby. What did I do? Oh, here it is. 10. <laughs> and then I need 7. 7 connects to 10. There's that, and three, there's three. Okay, that was the best tip ever that it has the numbers on it. That was a lifesaver. I'm curious as to where you're seeing the numbers. They're right down here. See, oh. three, seven, ten. That is like the best thing ever. Can you see those little numbers on there? I was so, like, the first time I did this, I had to go lay out all the toys, and then I had to look and see which one was what. So thank you for that pro tip. That was a saving grace. And then five. Okay, so there's the other half of the RV. And then we're going to whoa, take this very gently because it falls apart. <laughs> And I'm going to connect it over here. So now I've got ah, the main there we go. part of my RV here. It is really, really hard to keep it together. Oh. Sorry, guys. I can't keep it together on camera. I'm losing it. Okay. Ah. Okay, and then I need top. Yeah, that would be helpful. <laughs> Slide that in. Yep. Oh no. Okay, sort of. That kind of helps. Okay, and then the back goes on there. That helps a lot, but it's still not like perfect. And I think also, doesn't matter which you side have to kind of have those over. Okay, so there it is, all put together. See, and then the back actually the um, the little like flinging thing from Forky goes on here. And it looks like the ladder on the back of the Maybe RV. Maybe that thing needs to slid over? Well, no, if you slide it over, it kind of like... Oh. So, but I think it's supposed to stick in here. 
I don't know. Oh, yeah, yeah. In the, so yeah. then there's the ladder on the back of the RV. Three minutes and 46 seconds. That wasn't too bad. Not too bad. I'm impressed with myself. And then I did notice, too, that the stickers, um, there was options for, like, blank windows. But I thought it was more fun to put all the characters in the windows. So you've got Mr. 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 and Mrs. Potato Head. Um, and you've got Bullseye and Slinky. I love the Slinky Dog one in the back. And yeah, there's the um, options for the blank windows. Yeah. And then you've got the sheep and, oh my gosh, what's the unicorn's name? Oh my gosh, how am I forgetting the unicorn's name? Ah! And I don't know what the dummy's name was. Does anybody remember? And I can't remember the hedgehog's name. I'm not very good at the Toy Story 3 characters. Yeah. Because Toy Story 3 was not my favorite. Vincent, Vincent yeah. yeah. I liked Toy Story 3. But I think one and two and four are my favorites. Three is probably my least favorite. And Hammy and Rex. Oh, and you didn't you didn't use these guys? No, I was super sad when I like I stuck all the stickers on and then I saw those guys were an option. I was like, uh, ugh, I might have done that instead of creepy Vincent. Yeah. I did like those guys. Those guys were so funny. They were really and I funny. loved the very, very end when he finally gets his high five. Did you guys see that at the very, very end? You wait. We're a, we are a credit family. We always stay for the yep. credits. Not because we want there to be something at the end of the credits, but because we think that everybody that worked hard on the film deserves the credit yep. for being, for all the work that they did and that we shall stay and watch. So. And we have a lot of friends that work in the movie industry who yeah. show up in those credits. Yeah. Um, and then you can stick these guys on the top. The, like box shows them all on there <laughs> i have not figured out how i'm i'm guessing they're not all that. attached oh uh, maybe they are maybe i don't know i mean there are a lot of pegs up here but i've never been able to like oh you know what she's not up there figure out how to get them all on there because a lot of them ah uh, a lot of them <laughs> take up two we all should right. have started that timer how long till it falls We're apart gonna put this down on the ground so, uh, anyway, we do have a full set of these that we wanted to give away because um, as we were collecting them, we mm -hmm. wanted to collect two sets. So, I think what we're going to do is actually, after this video posts, um, you'll want to go down into the comment section mm -hmm. and leave a comment with who your favorite Toy Story or character was so some it could be somebody that was in any of the toy story movies mm -hmm. or somebody maybe new from toy story 4 um so let us know who your favorite toy story 4 character is so it does have to be somebody that's in toy story 4 it can't be somebody like i don't think lots like lots would not work because no. he was did not appear in toy story 4 so it has to be a Toy Story 4 character. Who is your favorite Toy Story 4 character? Um, comment that in the comment section down below if you want a chance to win. And then we will announce the winner. Um, Some future live. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if we'll do it next week. If we're going to do a tech talk, we might wait and do it one week after mm -hmm. that. Um, so we did have a couple other fun Disney things, Toy Story things. Disney. So I'm hoping that Wally will wake up. He's been sleeping for like an hour. He's a he's sleeping in our bed right over there, and he's like the soundest sleeper. He just just cannot be bothered to wake up. So, um, your daughter had to go potty. <laughs> Buttercup. All right. So, um, when we did a box swap with Disney Junkie Ashley, she sent us one of these. I'm trying to find it. I have it here. There it is. She sent one of these for Wally. It is one of the Toy Stories Hot Wheels. Um, oh, during during end credits, she had to go potty. Yeah, I know Wally. Wally made it to the end, but Mark has this app called Run P. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's his like favorite app because I Mark is notorious for like, he cannot make it through a movie without having to go pee. Like it could yep. be a 20 minute documentary. Just 20 minutes. He would still yep. have to go pee. Launch run pee. I mean, we can drive all the way across Nebraska to Iowa and he won't have to go pee once. But if we go to a movie, he will have to pee at least once. So he has this app called run pee. Run pee. And what happened, uh, you can show you how it works. Yeah. 
So when you go to a movie, like you just pick any movie that's in the theaters. Um, so, oh, that's oh nice. I forgot and to do this. Like yeah. Survey you. Uh, actually, that was better than, yeah. Okay. okay. So you pick what movie you're going to. Mm. What are you doing? It's, I'm so. It's like <laughs> they've now they've now it now started to ask you to rate movies before and after. Ah, okay. Um, before we'll the, do that later. Before the movie, men around age 35 generally rated it higher than all users, but mm, after it, it went down. What is this like an app just for men? Is it just is. like a man it's problem probably, when you go to a movie? It, it probably. I don't know. Okay. Hold on. I'm still getting there. Oh, okay. my gosh. Okay. okay. Here we go. So you pick what movie you're going to. Toy Story 4. And then it tells you the optimal time to go mm -hmm. potty. And then while you're going potty... It gives you the whole plot, like everything you're missing while you're going potty. So it gives you a summary of what's happening. It's actually a really cool concept. Um, Mark's used it for a long time. Mm -hmm. Had it for years. And he's always been able to keep up with going, what's going on. Yep. So Yeah, so here it, it kinda you kinda go into it. And Hi, it shows you, so the first one up here at the top is eight minutes and 25 Come seconds into the Come movie, here. and it's two and a half minutes long. Take that off. And then it kind of gives you that summary, so read that on the way oh, to the bathroom. Uh, or it has a recommended run, run P, 34 minutes into the movie, and it's almost four minutes long. And you may remember this section. I think Bo is driving, that week's volume. Bo is driving around. Yeah. Second Chance Antiques, I'm kind of boring part of the movie. And I think that's the one that we... Yes. So it gives you a couple on. options yep. for run peeing. But yep. it gives you... it will It buzzes in your pocket and lets you know, like, mm -hmm. now's a good time to go. Yep. So, And then it tells you when to start it. Like, it'll say, you know, like, when the star shoots over the castle, hit go. Yep. So, anyway. And then it will tell you if there's anything at the end and what is there. Yes. Is there anything at the end? However, we always stay for the end, no matter yes. what the movie, no matter what. So I always know. Um, so that's Run P, because I know truly that's why you're all here tonight, is you wanted to, <laughs> to know, when is the optimal time to pee during Toy Story 4? Yes. Maybe we should retitle our We should retitle our life. We have the Happy Meal unboxing this. <laughs> giving away all the secrets on yep. the best time to go to the bathroom yep. in blockbuster films. Maybe yep. that'll just be the whole premise of our yep. channel moving forward. I also like, because this is also very valuable for us, it gives us a synopsis of the first three minutes of a movie if you're running late. Yes. Which is like ours which... starts the movie, like the credit, the the... the Trailers start at the start time, so you've got 25 minutes until the movie starts. So at that point, if you're yeah. already three minutes late, you're now a half like hour Lion late. Like Lion King, movie. we got we there 20 about late, 20 right? minutes late, yeah. and we didn't even it hadn't even started yet. No. So, hi, thanks for joining us. Yeah. Um, somebody asked a question. Uh, when did Ashley. you potty train Wally? Um, we kind of started with him around the time he turned two. I think he was maybe little, like. Maybe three or four months in, yeah. um, because it was around January. Yeah, it was kind of January, around, February this year. Yeah, like winter time. So, mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I mean, he's he's fully potty trained now. He went a whole week in Disney, and he had no accidents. Well, he had two accidents, but they were really both our fault. So I don't even really count them as accidents on his behalf. Yeah. Um, but yeah, he did he did well with it. We used a lot of bribery. <laughs> That's why we have so many Hot Wheels cars because. That was what worked for him. Yep. He wanted cars. So speaking of cars, this was one you had sent us, Ashley, um, in our box swap. And I was like, that is so cool. I've never seen these. And so when we were in Disney, my mom actually texted me and was like, hey, do you have these Toy Story cars? And I was like, no, I've been looking for those. So she found the whole collection. Do do? I don't even know where. Um, but we have all of those. So I thought those would be fun to show you guys and then we'll see if wally wants to wake up and open some cars because we've got lots of room rooms wally do you want to come open up some room rooms you gotta wake up bud wake up wally i have room rooms usually that works okay so i think these have an order on them Okay, so number one is Woody, of course. And I think these ones are really funny because they all have names. Um, this is the Boulevard Bruiser. I don't know if that's the name of the 
That's Har? Har. Oh, yeah. Look at that. But anyway, they're just funny names. Boulevard Bruiser. I don't know anything about cars. I think if that has not become apparent. Um, I bet Mia will be easy. I think she'll she'll take to it. I mean, you think, I think you just have to kind of figure out what works well for them, too. Um, yeah, so there's Woody. And I'd like to open these up. Let me go see if I can get Wally to wake up. Can I open them all? Well, Wally will be excited to open them. Okay. Well, Biggie's going to go, Biggie's gonna go help. Wally, well, this would be a great time for a commercial break <laughs> as we wake Wally up. Um, Thank you all for your support of the channel. Our uh, our goal of getting over 200 subscribers, as you all know, was met, and um, you know now we're well on our way uh, to the next milestone. Um, so thank you all for your support and support of the channel. We greatly uh, appreciate it. Um, we kind of talked a lot about uh, some of our upcoming videos at the beginning, but I'll give a refresh for anyone uh, who wasn't here at the beginning. Um, we have a uh, Lion King. Okay. Themed video coming Who's out. On the uh, we have the rest of our Walt Disney World trip uh, coming up, um, and here near term we have an Apollo Eleven uh, Aviation Day coming up. So okay, and the star has decided bug. to join us. Here's Wally Bug. Oh, he's waking up. But there's no better way to wake up than with cars, huh? Oh, oh Biggie found something else in there. Okay. Okay. So yeah, actually, it was it was nice to have Wally potty trained um, before Disney. I always remember it's public bathroom, so you're gonna have that to contend with. Um, whereas changing a diaper <laughs> could be a little bit easier. A lot less stuff to tote around. It was a lot less stuff to tote around. Um, and I think actually, I mean, I don't like public restrooms <laughs> at all, but I would take taking a small child potty versus having to change a diaper. Yeah. in a public restroom just because i mean like those changing tables you don't know and i guess we just we've had some we've had some bad experiences and we talked about that in another video so we don't even get mad yeah so we, we were happy to be able to mm -hmm. do the potty thing mark did most of the potties i just couldn't handle it i'm a little bit of a germaphobe so do you want to open up woody yeah yeah okay so we're gonna open up woody the Boulevard Bruiser. So cool. Oh. Do you want your Lightning McQueen cup? Yeah. Daddy, go get it for you. Whenever he's really tired, he always says, we know COVID. Show the camera. Hi. Say hi, Wally. Hi, Wally. Hi. You can say hi. Hi. Can I see it swing strong? So there's Woody. That's a really cool car. That is a cool car. Yeah. It's got the sheriff star on the front. It's pretty cool. Oh, it actually, even the star, there's no way you're going to be able to see that, I don't think. But it actually does say Woody. I don't think I can hold it steady enough. That's really cool. Potty training tips for Disney World is some of the resort oh, bathrooms have day. little sinks. Yeah, and any of, some the, of the, um, the care centers... Um, they do have um, oh. toddler potties. Yep. Oh. So that can be a great thing oh, if, you're, oh, if you're potty training. Oh, okay. Do you want to open up the next one? Yeah. You got to show first. Yeah. So this is number two. Oh. Who is this, Wally? Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. And this is the Nerf Hammer. Is that really the name of a car? I'm guessing. I don't think these are really names of cars. You don't think so? I don't know. I don't know anything about cars. Um, I know we need to build like a, I've seen those things where you can build like the Hot Wheels, like, like car garages and stuff. There are a ton of YouTube videos on just Hot Wheels cars and you can see oh, their setups. So <laughs> okay. okay, he's gonna <laughs> open it. He's like, he's like, enough talking, open the car. Do you want me to help you? Oh, You've got a bunch more. Hello. Um, we actually one of our future projects um, is to build a Disney wall. Mm -hmm. So if that is something we've got on our list. Yep. So let's show him Buzz. Let's show him Buzz. Ooh, Buzz is cool. He's purple. The whatever cool this color wheel. Oh, yeah. Oh. The Buzz hammer. 
The buzz hammer. Oh, the nerve the hammer. The nerve hammer. Nerve hammer. Here you go. Here's Buzz. No, no. I'm pretty sure. All right. Time no, to... We'll get that one. Irene knows how much I don't like uh, not knowing the facts to um, share with you all. So. Hubby wants to keep them in the box. I know. We we open them up. Just with Wally. There's no way we could keep them in the box. Does Mia like cars? Is she into cars? Um, I've heard girls can be easier. Yeah, I mean, Wally no, was actually pretty yeah. easy with potty training. It was not. We heard girls could be easier, too. Yeah, I, mean. I was surprised with how easy it was. With it. Yes, it was correct. The Nerve Hammer is a design of Hot Wheels vehicle, so. Oh, it's a design um, of Hot Wheels. Yes, it's a yeah, uh, design of the vehicle. Oh, there was, like, real cars. Yeah, and so then they have all these, you know, like, the first edition oh, of it was translucent um, it was on the red. Hot Wheels wiki. Yep. Even though that was a thing. Yep. Released in 2006. Um, Let's see if they've up. I'm, yeah. I'm sure they've updated it. Do you ready to open the next one? Okay, well, what's number three? Oh, I love this one. No. This is number three. This is the oh, no. Velocita? I don't know. But it's Jesse. That one is so cool. Should we open that one up? Yeah. Okay. Let's open up Jesse. So the Hot Wheels wiki is obviously not that, you know, ahead of the game community Ooh, because they don't it. have the Toy Story Buzz one listed. There's Jesse. So cool. So there's Jesse. It's a Velocida car, if that's how you pronounce it. Okay, so the number four, I like this one a lot too. Number four Velocita. is Rex. Oh, Wally's off to something. I don't know what he's off to. Number four is Rex, and he is the the power panel. Kind of looks like a like a jeep. What? Slink, you rode Slinky Dog, didn't you? Well, he wants to launch Slinky Dog. You want to launch Slinky Dog? Oh, oh yeah. What does Slinky say? What does Slinky say? Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. And then he went down the hill. This is scary. See, he's got Slinky on his shirt. I love the I little love Slinky, the butt. slinky dog, but yeah. it's kind of a messy shirt after the day. But yeah, we love this one. <laughs> um, hey, Lisa. Thanks for hey, hopping Lisa. on. So this is the Rex, the Rex mobile. That one's really cool. It's like clear on the top. You can see the little seats in there. Hot Topic has the Toy Story 4 mystery ah, pin. What? Okay. Um, and Ashley, I am I am planning on going down to the box some store. I know you gave me a warning not to, but I, I just want to go check it out. And okay, so we showed you the to... alien. The alien's number five. And hold on, bud. Okay. And we're actually not going to open this one up. So we will probably um, include this in the little giveaway. No, no, so... Um, Hold on, let me show them first. Yeah, show them. And then the last one, six number six, is Bo Peep. And this one's really ah. cool, too. Hold on, buddy. Ah. Hold on. So there's Bo Peep. And I actually kind of like these a little bit better than the Toy Story 4 Hot Wheels. I don't know. These ones are just really fun because I like that they like the have what? the characters on them because we have oh, the other set of other ones. cars yeah. and they kind of more like look like the character and these are more yeah. like the cars yeah. yeah oh and Bo is the pony up pony up pony up I feel like that should have been Jesse Jesse should have been the pony up right opportunity lost okay this one's really cool let me show them let me show them there's Bo Peep Oh, don't it's got like a clear pink oh, top. Oh, okay, okay. I, I like Bo Peep too. Yeah. yeah. Wally, what's what's your favorite one? What's your favorite one? Oh, oh dear. all of them. That's your favorite. Is all of them? He likes all of them. Mm. There's a surprise. Mm. Okay, I think we have two more Toy Story things to open up. What? Um, one of them is over there. What? Are you here. Molly, where's your where's your buddy, your pal that we just bought? There he is. I see oh. him. Do you want to bring him over here and open him up? Bring him over. Ah, uh, dog. In case you're wondering who it is, Leon. Who is it, Wally? Who is it? Who is it? Slinky dog. Slinky dog. Look at how cute he is. 
Yeah, now you get to open them up. I told Wally he had to wait until we did our live. Lisa had a question on when we're po posting the Universal vlog. That'll be vlog. a while it's out. Be a while. Um, yeah, because yeah, our second half of Magic Kingdom will post, which was the third. Yeah, it is done. And then it'll be. Yeah, it'll probably be August. Won't be this Saturday. It'll be like three, four more Saturdays. And it could get bumped for Galaxy's Edge. You never know. Yeah, we'll have to see. It just depends on where it falls. So we actually found this guy at Joanne's Fabrics. Joanne's Fabrics. They had um, a bunch of stuff on clearance. And I've been wanting to get him a cool slinky dog. And I just thought this one was so cute. So we'll have to put it on our Disney wall when we do that. Yeah. Well, can you sh come show the camera? They want to see Slinky. Yeah, come show the camera. Come here. show him. You can you can walk him on here. Walk him on there. Do, 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 do. Hang on. <laughs> oh, it's good. It comes oh, with, thanks uh, for joining us, Point Bags. Thanks for hopping on. It's fun to have you here. So here's Slinky. <laughs> He's got a string in there, so I'm that's nice. hoping that'll be like pretty sturdy and keep him yeah. connected for a while. But I just thought that was so cute. Um, let's see. Okay, we have one more thing to open up. Mom says, "Sit down, Wally." <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, so this was another thing that you had sent us, Ashley. Um, can I see? Can I see Buzz? So this was one of those little squishies that you had sent, and he loves this thing, as you can probably tell, because he's getting a little worn. So they had these in the clearance bin at Joanne's, too. They were like, I don't know, I think maybe 50% off, maybe more. So these are the little mashems, and that's everybody that can be inside. Um, it has Ducky. I'm going to guess the mystery one is Bunny. Um, Forky, Buzz, Woody, or Bo. So we're gonna open this one up. Do you wanna open it up? And see who's in here? Yeah. Who do you think's gonna be in here? Oh hey, bunny. The Easter bunny? Yeah. <laughs> Wally loves anything bunny and he calls it Easter bunny. Mm. Yeah. You think that's the Easter bunny for sure? Do you wanna open it and see? You better come sit on my lap. You can bring Slinky if you want. You wanna bring Slinky? Yeah. Okay, hang on. Who's in here? Oh, we have a request to show the McDonald's set. <laughs> yes, I together. will show it all put together again. Um, well, he's Mark's twin. Yeah, he definitely has some characteristics of his dad. All right, you want to open it up? Yeah. <gasps> open it up. Who's in there? Ooh. Oh, my Aww. gosh. <laughs> oh, no, we dropped it. That's funny. Well, well, that's what you get with is it, mystery toys. It's another Buzz Lightyear. Buzz Lightyear. So maybe, should we include that in our giveaway? No. No, no you want to keep it? Yeah. We'll see if I can con convince him not. No. Okay. <laughs> maybe we'll, you know what? Maybe we can go back and get a different one. See if we can get somebody other than Buzz Lightyear. Are they all Darn blue Buzz. containers? They are all blue containers. So. So we got another buzz, but that's okay because our buzz is, uh, he's seen some better days. Yeah. So maybe we'll Sleepy include this dog. Dog. We'll give away. There's Sleepy Dog. Okay, we have a request to see the bus put together mm -hmm. again. It's mostly still put together. But Whoa! Gotta go up a little higher, buddy. Plus, they can't you're, see plus it. you're probably like knocking your eardrums out. Probably. <laughs> Sorry about that. Here, Wally, do you want to do it on this? Sure. Thank you, dog. What's he say, Wally? Hold on. Hold on. Hang on. Wally says, hold on. Uh, yeah, Disney, Disney. Yeah, Disney Mom, sure that's a good idea. Story three. There were two Buzz Light years. <laughs> Um, that's were. true. When the first one breaks, that probably is not a bad idea because he loves that thing. He, I mean, he literally takes it with him in the car every day. So, okay, Mom, here's the bus put together per your request. So there it is all put together. There's the front. I wish they would have put, like, characters in the front. That would have been yeah. cute. Oh, maybe you could put those little uh, army men. Maybe. 
Weren't they the drivers? No, I don't remember. I need to see it again. I'm excited for that to come out. So there it is all put together. And then you can put the characters on top as well. No! Biggie's trying to eat the uh, yeah. chocolates. And Wally and Biggie fight like siblings. It's kind of a problem because I'm pretty sure he thinks he's a dog a lot of the time. So, let's see if I can get him on. It's really hard to. Yeah, so you can put the guys on the top. No! No, no, no. So, Lisa, I know you hopped on a little no. bit later. No. And if anybody else is joining us later, we are going to give away this full set. So if you weren't able to get all of these from McDonald's in their bag, condition, so, you know, with their, if you want to just sell them on eBay and make millions of dollars. With their price thingy, so like, you yeah, have you to quickly I know. enter those. So we, what you have to do to be eligible to win is once we are done being live yep. and we post the video, go, to the video. go down to the comment section. And um, leave a comment with who your favorite Toy Story no, 4 no, character was. No, no, so it has no. to be somebody that was in. So the children oh, are fighting. Oh, Holly, I think she's okay. She's not gonna, She's just playing with you. Oh, she wants to play with you. Um, go get her bunny. Oh, I didn't even realize this. Okay, so this is brilliant. So all the little spinner toys, those are actually the wheels. What? So it actually lines up to where the oh, wheels are. In his front? Yeah, yeah, so it actually would like go. I didn't even realize that. Yeah, you should. Here, let's demonstrate pushing it along. Yeah, I'm sure. It is. There you go. It didn't fall apart. Well, even though you didn't see it, you've probably seen previews for it, at least. And, so. and if you need a name of any And it can be, it can be, um, it doesn't have to be somebody. Who it doesn't have to be somebody new or unique to play Star for. They, see what I mean? They fight like siblings. Yes. This is not two kids. This is a kid and a kid a dog. And a very large dog. And I also think Biggie's hungry, and so she's like being super yeah. playful. Yeah. You want to eat? Yeah, she wants to eat. I think yeah. she wants her dinner. Oh, yeah, leave a comment. Guys guys over here. I'll show you. Oh, yeah. oh, he's got the light. Okay. Yeah. No. Eat. Be nice to your sister. Oh, you want to eat? Biggie eat. wants to eat. You Biggie, are you eat. hungry? You hungry? Not Biggie, us. if you're hungry, bark. Are you hungry? Bark. Biggie, do you want dinner? Yeah. Do you want dinner? Yeah. 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 Should we just give all the food to the cat? No. <laughs> <laughs> what? Do you have something you want to tell us? Hey, should we give the food to the cat? No? No. We shouldn't give the food to the cat. <laughs> I don't know if you ever saw that YouTube video where the guy is talking to his dog and he's like, uh, I made this great sausage. And then, and then he like gave it to the cat. Up the dog. Uh, and the dog's like, Aww. uh oh. Well, he's oh, got the light. You can't commandeer the light, man. <laughs> That's not a toy. Right. I think we are quickly falling apart yep. here. So I <laughs> answer the question. Yep. Hearing. They're both three yeah. years old. Yes. Biggie was born in May. Wally was born in August, same year. They're so like they are like three, three months yeah. apart. <laughs> well, we had another dog when we were pregnant. She died of cancer, and so I had to get healthy. And so we have two three nagers right now. Although, arguably, Biggie's more like, Mama. I don't know, Ellie. like a 20 year old. Oh, I think you're okay. I think you're just being crabby because you woke up from a nap. Yeah. You need to be she nice. Can, she kind of stepped on him. Oh, did Biggie step on your toe? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think you'll be okay. Oh, I think you'll survive. All right, well, thank you for joining our yes. live again. We're going to go live on Tuesdays, varying topics. Yep, we're um, talking about next Tuesday doing a... Tech Talk Tuesday, so talking about all things tech, family, and just fun it. Oh, did she hit you on your head? No, that's a sleep spot. Yeah. That is a good sleep spot. You were sleeping hard over there. Yeah. Weren't you? Yeah. You didn't want to wake up. All right. Well, thanks for watching us today. We appreciate the support once yes. again. 
Don't forget um, to comment down below who your favorite Toy Story 4 character is. Yep, yep. The live should be around the same time, 6 o'clock Mountain, yes. 5 Pacific, 8 Eastern. Let's go 7 Central, 6. Uh, we hit them all. I don't know Hawaii or Alaska time or overseas. I don't. Um, no. We're in mountain time. She's not gonna She's hurt not your gonna toys. Take that, buddy. Come here. She wants food. Come here. We gotta do our outro. Can you come say goodbye? Bean. She wants to eat. Yeah. yeah. You want to eat bean. <laughs> come here, bud. Come say goodbye. Come say goodbye. And then, we'll go, and then we can go feed Biggie. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. All right. Okay. This is the wonderful world of Walter, <laughs> and we love you just the way you are. Can you say bye. 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 Thanks for watching. And now, no, no, bye. No.